I got, I got a real special guest for us this morning as we focus in on retail. Dollar General. Okay, now they found success positioning themselves as the go to store for rural America. They bucked the downward trend for bricks and mortar. They're actually expanding. And look who's here. Cal Turner. Now, he is the founding CEO of Dollar General. He's been retired for 15 years. Yes, sir. He still shows up on time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing well, and I'm delighted to be here. Okay. 14,000 stores. More, more than, than 14,000. Okay. Um, now, we've got tax reform. It's in place. It's very good for retailers. Yes, are you man. now planning, uh, your company, are you planning to expand even more? That company has always been an expanding company, and I understand that they have more planned now, and tax reform will certainly be of help. Okay, now um, you've got no competition from Amazon. Not really. Well, now there is always competition in the country. <laughs> yeah. Well. You, there are fewer customers there, and you have to know your customer well and serve your customer well, and Dollar General's role is being in stock on the consumable basics when you run out of toilet paper. Yes, but you're also, your role also <laughs> is to be where no other stores are so that they can go to your store and take over the town. That's what you do. Well, that, we want to be where the customers are, and if there are fewer other stores there, that is good, but we want to serve the customers. In fact, that company, at the end of this year, will serve 75% of the population of the continental United States with a store within five miles. When are you going to go overseas? Oh, we have too much to do here. I, I think they do. I, I, I'm not speaking for them now. Right. I'm a retired old fart. <laughs> no, no, you're retired. Can oh, I'm sorry. That? That's not politically. <laughs> Please disavow everything else. I'm not politically correct, but and do, I enjoy but, it. But you were the CEO for many, many years, obviously, and About you set 37. them on this course. So you set out the store to go out there to rural America and appeal in a certain way. Do you want to see any changes? Because not the right question to ask it. <laughs> if you could make any changes, what would they be? Well, I don't think I would make any changes because they know how to run that company a lot better than we did, but the foundation was set. Where's the headquarters for Dollar General? In Goodlettsville, Tennessee, yeah. which is just north of Nashville. And you've retired in Tennessee, haven't you? Yes. Mm -hmm. And I think you've retired in Tennessee because, A, there's no estate tax, and, B, there is no income tax, state income tax. Am I right? That had something to do with it. <laughs> I thought it would. Yeah, that's right. That had, yeah. I mean, I, I'm from Kentucky, but we're, we understand taxes and <laughs> yeah, things do. like that. Well, what do you do? I mean, are you a happy man retiring? I am. I, I asked the question because I'm 69 and a half. I could retire. I don't know whether I'm going to or not, but I could. What would I do with myself if I retired? What do you do with yourself for the last 15 years? I enjoy life, and I continue to pursue my mission. Which is? God-honoring change. And there are struggling people out there today who need the help of a philanthropist. Dollar General is there to serve struggling people to give them a better life. And to be there for them with what they need that they've run out of and will be in stock, or they will be in stock at a Dollar General store. When you run out of toilet paper, Stuart. Well, if I could find a mission in life like that, yeah. maybe I, too, would retire. I, mean, I want to congratulate you, Cal, because uh, you're a great man, and you've done a fine job with your company. I'm proud of that company. Shake that yeah. hand, son. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Thank you. Thanks for being with us. Uh, may I wish you a Merry Christmas? You may indeed. Merry Christmas. <laughs> yes, sir. Thank you very much, Cal. Thank Appreciate you. Appreciate it. Thank you very now, much.